as far as the points table is concerned, there's not too many different uh, variants of that except the numbers that can vary and this could become very interesting because uh, if it becomes a one point each affair, that net run rate will not be affected. Sri Lanka and Pakistan will both have one point each, so they'll all jump to third and fourth on the table without really having to do very much. And given that, I'd say that if, the, if there is no match today, and I hope there is, I think Pakistan will feel the more hardly the hard done because they've had just had this fantastic victory. They're coming off a victory. They're looking at least so far a better team than Sri Lanka is. You know, Sri Lanka huffed and puffed a bit to even beat Afghanistan. And they'd say that this was two points. Pakistan would have said these are two points which would have been really useful to me. And I, they wouldn't have wanted to share these points. I, Sri Lanka also would probably say that, you know, we fancy our chances against Pakistan because they're so unpredictable. So I think both teams would be unhappy. You know, often you have a situation where one team is happy. Yaar. I want to take that single point and go. I don't think either team will be happy today. That's my point. Yeah, I might remember the, ninth, the last time we had this format. India played Sri Lanka and Mackay in 1992. Yeah, four and balls that, or something. Yeah. yeah, four balls. Kapil Dev came to open the batting over there. And that's when you kind of look back at times like that and say that, hmm, Maybe India were a little aggrieved on that occasion because of the difference between the sides. But on this occasion, Pakistan have a 7-0 record against Sri Lanka. Yeah, looking at that record, they would certainly want uh, to go out there, play the the match, you know, and 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 back those points for sure. For for any team, I feel it's always good to just go out there, play the game, and and get those two points. You know, that's the uh, uh, that's the most important thing because uh, when. Uh, when this one point comes into play, at times it, it becomes very tricky, you know. So so that's that's something which uh, which as as a cricketer, as uh, as a team, you would always want to go out there and and fight for those two points. You may lose uh, those <laughs> those points altogether, but it doesn't matter. I think you know that's the that's the most uh, most important thing. Uh, but the points table, when you're looking at it uh, right now, I think you know there, there will be one point where uh, with it just kind of will start uh, stabilizing. You know, that's what that's something which you always see in uh, in format uh, uh, in formats like these. So I think around five matches, once I, all the teams have played around uh, five, four, five games, then you'll start to see uh, this table stabilizing, Indeed and that does. will be the interesting uh, phase of the tournament. You know, right now it's just a build-up. Uh, you know, you've seen some uh, so-called upsets, some good uh, good performances. Uh, you don't want to see this uh, one uh, one point match at this stage uh, in the tournament. And it does one advantage. One advantage of a one point match for the teams who are there is it nullifies run rate. Because normally you'll be in a situation yeah. where run rate for that team will not so for be... For the losing team, it's not going down. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. So, it, that's the one thing that, you know, after this, they'll say, we just have to win. Now, run rate, because when you're in an odd number and not too many matches get washed out, then you're in a situation where run rate may make a huge difference. I will not make any difference to you.